speaking of garbage, wow, look what's happening right now on Capitol Hill. What a what what a what a bombshell this is. Breaking now on the Mike Gallagher show. James Comer, the chairman of the House Oversight Committee is addressing reporters in a in a press conference on Capitol Hill uh, revealing that over a million dollars flowed from a crooked Romanian businessman to the Biden family while Joe Biden was VP and while he promised to clean up corruption in Romania. Here we go. Let's take you now to Capitol Hill and James Comer. Since taking the gavel in January, the Committee on Oversight and Accountability has accelerated its investigation of the Biden family's domestic and international business practices that we began in Congress. I want to be clear. This committee is investigating President Biden and his family's shady business deals that capitalize on Joe Biden's public office and risked our country's national security. This committee has a duty to ask questions and pursue the facts no matter where they take us. Through the committee's investigation, we intend to provide transparency to the American people and reach legislative solutions. In only four months since obtaining subpoena authority, we have made astonishing progress. Today, we'll talk about that progress. First, we want to discuss information the committee has learned since our last press conference in November. New information investigators have uncovered regarding the transfer of money from foreign entities to the Biden family. Many of the wire payments occurred while Joe Biden was vice president and leading the United States efforts in these countries. First instance, while Vice President Biden was lecturing in Romania on anti-corruption policies, in reality he was a walking victim and family to collect money. Hunter Biden and his associates capitalized on a lucrative financial relationship with a Romanian national who was under investigation for and later convicted of corruption in Romania. The Bidens received over $1 million for the deal. And 16 of the 17 payments to their associate's account that funneled the Biden's money occurred while Joe Biden was vice president. Do you have information regarding the Biden's relationship with China? This includes two individuals the committee is particularly concerned about. One of them, Yu Jinming, had close ties to the highest levels of the Chinese Communist Party and operated a multi-billion dollar energy company with access to large sums of money. We'll discuss how the Bidens received millions of dollars from this individual through the use of shell companies and wire transfers. In March, the committee released its first bank records memorandum that showed a Biden associate, Rob Walker, used his company to funnel money from the Chinese to various Biden family members. Democrats dismissed the evidence, even though it was based on bank records directly from the bank. The Democrats on the Oversight Committee received the same records as the Republicans, and they were able to verify the information. Democrats said all the bank records showed were Papa John's and Starbucks receipts. They deliberately chose to misconstrue and deny what was clearly in front of them. Hunter Biden's representatives claimed the money was, quote, good faith seed funds, but could not explain why those funds had to go through an intermediary in what appears to be an attempt to hide the transfers from the Chinese. They also couldn't explain why the Bidens received over $1 million in 16 different wire transfers over a period of three months to at least five different banks. The president, when confronted with this information, said it wasn't true. Instead of being with, honest with the American people, President Biden has claimed since the 2020 election that his family has not received money from China. That was a lie in 2020, and he continues to lie to the American people now. The Bidens have received millions of dollars from China. It is inconceivable that the president did not know it. Wow. So House big news from Capitol Hill. That's uh, James Comer, chairman of the House Oversight Committee, uh, laying out the case that the Biden family was enriched 
by companies like or countries like China, Romania. Of course, we all know about Burisma and Ukraine and the fact that Hunter Biden was being paid millions. What a grotesque, corrupt uh, example of families grifting. And I've said it over and over again, the Bidens sure seem like a family full of grifters. Will it matter? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Are they trying to push Grandpa Joe out?